my, my favorite programming hack in Python is that uh, you can overload functions um, with the at sign by overriding its uh, matrix multiplication uh, meta method. I really like ternary operators. I don't know why, but every time I use one, uh, it makes me feel smart and it makes my code look elegant. Uh, so I try to use them wherever possible. PDB, like the Python debugger, and being able to stop your program state at any point in time and then like simulate what, what could have happened if you wrote other code instead, I think is super useful. Like it makes deep learning interactive debugging. It's like fantastic. Well, this is more like a library that's very, very common in uh, people that use machine learning. It's called TQDM. It's, a, it's very simple. It's just a progress indicator. Uh, but once you start using, uh, like training these large models, you'll just realize just how useful it is to have that little progress bar um, showing you how far your model has gone with training and uh, evaluation too. One powerful feature of MATLAB is that you can use uh, matrix operations. So instead of working with numbers individually, you can uh, put them in a matrix, put them in vectors, and um, do processes on them at once. And it's really powerful because um, this tool is really optimized for working with matrices really fast, so you can get things done much, much faster. I don't know if it's a hack or what, but I can never remember which way the matrices go in matrix multiplication, right? It's just, you have no idea what's going on in a matrix multiplication. And, and sometimes it's just hard to think about. So instead of matrix multiplying, you can use the Einstein summation operator. And this allows you to explicitly state like what's going into the matrix multiply, how it's combining on the axes, and how it gets summed up. And a lot of people don't like the Einstein summation, but I, I'm, a, I'm an Einstein summation zealot that I, uh, I use it all the time. It saves me a ton of mental overhead and I never have to remember how the matrices fit together ever again.